hey guys welcome back to another video today i'll be showing you guys how we can get a desktop look pretty similar to mine except for the wallpaper so yeah and guys in this tutorial we uh, mainly focused on the taskbar because i've already made a video on how you can like put live wallpapers to your desktop for free and if you want to check that video out you can click the card in the top right corner and yeah so you can watch that video and you can put a live wallpaper to your desktop so now let's move on to the video Alright guys, now let's start with how you how to get your taskbar icons to the center of your taskbar. So actually there is two methods to do that. So the first one is you can do it manually and also you can do it with a help of a software. Personally I like the I like to do with a software because it's pretty easy and it's also easy to understand. So if you want to do with a software, you can open up your Google Chrome or any other browser you are using and go to Google and you can search as um task task bikes right here just search like that and it should be the first link you will get just click that and just scroll down just a little bit and if you want to get this from the microsoft store you can but you need to pay like one dollar also i can't actually remember the price but you can click on github which you can get this software for completely free so once you click that at the top you will see like this green button just click that and click on download zip and then it'll download a zip folder and all you want to do is um, open up your file explorer and then just go to the location where you save that like if you location where you download that file and after that you can see unzip this folder by right clicking and clicking extract here and once you extract that extract that folder go ahead and open up this taskbar x configurator just double click it to open it up and this is the software and as soon as you open up the software your icons in your taskbar will be moved on to the middle of your taskbar and how you can make your taskbar look transparent that's pretty simple all you want to do is click transparent under this style thing and click apply and now it will make your taskbar look transparent and if you would like you can play with the other settings but i don't think it's necessary because yeah and if you would like to you can play with the other settings so now i'm gonna x out of this software and now let's see how you can change the icons in your taskbar so that's pretty simple as you can see i also changed the file explorer icon so yeah now let's see how to do that so first of all all you want to do is open up your microsoft store i think a lot of you guys have the microsoft store and once you open up your microsoft store all you want to do is click on search and you need to, you need to search as pigeon and this is the software just click that and go ahead and download this software it's like i don't actually remember the size of the software so all you want to do there will be like install thing just click that and it will download on your computer and from this software you can get over 120,000 pro icons for free i think that's pretty good right and as you can this have a five star rating and yeah guys actually this one is a pretty good software not pretty good this is a very good software so download it and once you download the software go ahead and open up the software and your software lo should look like this so as you can see i've already searched for file explorer and yeah so now first of all what you want to do is right click in a empty area in your desktop click new and create a folder you can call this as icons yeah my spelling is pretty bad and and after that all you want to do is uh just open up this icon say picture and app after that click this like this circle and here you can change the color to any color you would like but i'm gonna with, go with the white color obviously you can choose any color you would like but i'm gonna go with white color yeah and after that all you want to do is click on search and then just search for the icon that you'll need so i'm gonna search as spotify and now you'll see all the spotify icons so as you can see there will be lots of cool different kinds of uh, spotify icons and guys personally i like this thing this windows metro one and i like this gradient line thing because it's like have it's like it's have like a gradient stroke going on and also i the my uh, best one is the windows 10 it's have like a white stroke around the uh, logo uh, it means the icon all right guys this is a little bit tricky but because if you want to change icons in windows 10 it means if you want to change i if you want to change software icons in Windows 10, you need to have that icon type as a ICO format. So how to save these icons in ICO format? 
so all you want to do is click this like png and click on ico as you can see right here and here you will get the the maximum pixel you can get is 64 pixels so you can enable 64 and you can uh, disable 32 and 16 pixels but if you pay for the software you can get the maximum quality it means 256 pixels so now once you enable 64 pixels all you want to do is open up your uh, the folder that you created and go ahead and put the icon that you need so just drag and drop the icon that you need onto this folder and now you get this uh, icon and now all you want to do is just put a shortcut on the software that you want to change the icon so i'm gonna put a sh uh, spotify shortcut onto my desktop and then just right click on the shortcut properties click on change icon browse and then just go to the location we have saved that uh file just select that click open okay and apply and okay and as you can see now it changed to the icon that we selected but the problem is the icon is pretty small and the main part is if you pin this um thing your uh this the software onto your taskbar that icon will look very small actually i can't even see that so how i managed to make my icons this big so if you're thinking i paid for the software no i actually don't pay for the software so all you want to do is right click and unpin it from the taskbar and then after all you want to do is again open up the picture nap right so now what i did was i changed the ico to png and i changed the pixel rate to 127 actually the uh, above 100 the the maximum pixel you can get from the png is 127 but if you want to change it to 256 you can obviously change it but some icons are not available it means you need to pay for this pay for them means for the icons but some are available as you can see this um these icons are available and also the the spotify icon choose i choose is also available in 256 pixels so all you want to do is once you uh, search for the icon again open up your google browser and such as photop.com which is a online free uh, free online photo editor and click on new project and go ahead and change the width and height to 256 by 256 and go ahead and change the background to transparent and click create and guys just ignore this as it's really annoying i don't know why it's up here on my screen so yeah but so now what you want to do is go ahead and open up the icon say it which an app and then just put the icon onto photo p just drag and drop it to photo p and as you can see now it's placed to photo p and let's say if you did not uh, find your icon in 256 pixels don't worry all you want to do is change this to 127 because as you can see if i change it to 128 uh, these are unavailable but if you change this to 127 all the icons are available so make make sure you are in using the 127 pixels so just see, uh, search for the icon that you will need and then drag drag that icon onto photo p and once you do that all you want to do is just select the icon that you uh, put and get your mool tools right here and all you want to do is select right click right here and if you did not get that controls make sure to enable uh, transform controls and select your icons lay and just make it a little bit big so like that and make while holding shift and alt key you can make it big as you the size you want to be so i'm gonna make it something like this and click on the check mark at the top and that's pretty much you guys want to do and click on file export as more and here we'll see the ico format click that and guys do not change the width and height to about 256 because the maximum pixel we can uh, the maximum pixel rate that windows accept for the ico format is 256 so make sure you are not uh, going about 256 and you can click on save and after that you can save it when you are in your, uh, in your computer and you can give a name so i'm going to rename it as spotify and you can click on save and now it will download that icon and then all you want to do is uh, i'm going to uh, get a copy of this so all you want to do is right click on the shortcut properties and click on change icon browse and select your icon open okay 
apply and ok and as you can see now it changed to a big uh, icon and now if you pin that onto your taskbar it's uh, big right and it's i think it's uh, pretty good size so yeah and that's how you can change the icons in your taskbar also all you want to do is just put all the software shortcuts onto your desktop that you want to pin to your taskbar and just do the same procedure i did to this um, spotify shortcut all right guys now let's see how you can change the icon on the file explorer so to change the file explorer it's pretty simple and also and also it's pretty different than the other icons uh, sorry other softwares so all you want to do is right click on file explorer and again right click on file explorer and click properties and you will get the properties tab of the file explorer and click change icon browse and just select the icon that you want to change and click on open so i'm not going to do that and once you do that your icons will not be changed so all you want to do is again open up your file explorer and minimize it and right click on your taskbar and click on task manager and you you want to select your windows explorer and click restart and once you click that your screen will be go to black screen just for one second and after that your icon the file explorer icon will be changed that way you can change the icon of your file explorer and yeah guys that's how we can make your taskbar look more clean and elegant and also you can how you can make your desktop look more clean and if you want to get this wallpaper i'm not sure you can get it but i actually animated it using a wallpaper engine uh, but if you want the non-animated wallpaper i will put a link to download it and yeah guys that's pretty much it for the video hope you enjoyed the video if you did be sure to like and subscribe the channel and yeah i will see you guys in the next video peace